Hey, what's up, guys? So today I'm going to be teaching you how to fix um, melted slime, which, if you can tell, that this slime is like melted, basically. Sorry. Like literally, it is melted. Like you can really just move it around. Like watch. Yeah. So, let's get started. What you're going to be needing to do is I'm going to use some of my trusty Tide. Put out a little more. Because I already have some in here. I just need more. Okay, I'm going to pour some Tide in here. It needs a lot of Tide because it's like... Add that all in there. I only use a little at first. Now, time to mix and mix. Because Tide makes it stringy like this, like if you can't tell, um, you just gotta keep on mixing and mixing. And it will really help, I guess. That's what you might want to say, but you just got to keep on mixing, mixing. See, it's extreme. If you can't really tell, but it is. Like, this slime, I made it, like, almost in the beginning of summer. So, of course, it is going to be very melted because of the heat. Great. I love when slime gets on my hands because then you remember for next time not to touch it. Just mix it all up. I wish I could pause this, but I can't because I'm on my iPhone. <laughs> so you guys are gonna have to deal with this. So yeah. So I'm trying to mix fast for you guys. Normally this takes like a few minutes. And then after it clumps up a lot, a little better, I try to get all the slime that is in there. And all this excess glue and stuff. Um, into the slime. So, yeah. And then normally I would take it out and play with it until it, like, became good. So that's what I'm going to be basically doing right now. And I'm just saying it still has tide in it. So... And a lot of my slimes get melted because I use contact solution before, but now I use Tide because it is better. And I can get a bigger thing of it and not waste it as fast. Like, guys, if you were playing with this, you would agree with me that it still feels really stringy. Like, really, can you tell that it's stringy right now? That's the one thing I don't really like about Tide is that it gets super stringy. And if you guys know how to prevent that, Comment down below. It's getting better. And guys, I will try to post a little more often. I just don't really get the much time to. But you guys can go follow me on Musical.ly. I post a lot. Or on like, because... Yeah. Both of them is Ms. Mia 7. I will put it in like the caption of this video or in the description down below. So yeah, right now I'm just trying to pick all of this out of the middle of my fingers because I freaking hate when that happens. So far, this is turning out pretty good. 
And you can tell that it's stringy. And I'm going to try to post a little bit this tomorrow. Well, probably not tomorrow, but maybe, hopefully, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and maybe Tuesday. Because I will be in Florida Disney World. Because if you didn't know, I live in Illinois. So, yeah. So, if you ever come and visit me, come, come and visit Illinois. Um, if you're out of, like, if you don't live there, like, comment down below. And maybe if you, like, want to meet up, you can. So, yeah. I love making bubbles and popping them for the next time. Like, one thing I hated about Contact Solution is that um, when you made bubbles, it made your slime more thicker and not fun to play with it. Like, if you poked it, it would just roll like this. Like, not even like that. It wouldn't make any noises. It would bend like this. But one thing I like about Tide is that it makes good clicking noises. them crackle apples because they're crackles and they're lackles oh yeah and don't worry soon I will get better lighting for my videos so yeah because um, soon I'm getting a little ring light to put on your phone. So, yeah. I would prefer to buy them. I would prefer to buy them because they're, like, really good. Like, guys, before this slime was not, like, even good. Like, I wish I should have took a before picture on the slime so that, like, I can edit the video and, like, put where it's, like, before and after, but, like, you guys could tell that this is way better. So, I will be right back. this I don't know what it's for it's dot to dot art but I just use it for this anyway you gotta dab it really hard like what I do sometimes is just squish that it gets it out a lot more and it like turned out yellow that's what I freaking hate about it Let's mix that in so far. For sure, it's not going to turn orange yet. It's going to be like a peach color so far. I know it is. Because it's going to be like a batter color first. Like if you guys can't see, like parts of it is already changing. Like I like to play around with it a little while it starts to change. Like if you guys can't tell. It still looks blue for you. Um, for me, it looks like a little yellow, sort of. A... I hate when my hair gets in my freaking face. Stop.
time to add in some more of this. Like it is gonna be orange by the time I'm done. Hi right, guys, I might post like a video on this time on my music player like account. So yeah. If you wanna see the finishing of the slime better, I will. Oh, that was a really good swirl. I love making swirls, guys. They're like my favorites. What you do is you go like this swirl. That was a really good one, though. So I'm gonna mix in that part first. Yeah, it's still got managed to get on my finger. So yeah. Let's move all that out of the way. Like it is barely even color for me, guys. Like I'm like not even shook. Like the stuff takes a lot of time. Okay. Well, if you want to see the finishing touches, like I think this is as orange I'm gonna get it. orange in it as I'm gonna get it um so yeah if you guys want to see the finishing touches of my slime then go check out my like and musically account well probably gonna be on my like account but yeah thanks guys bye